school year, I am pleased to present the prize for highest achievement in English to <sighs> Sincerity Travers. <laughs> is an honor. A totally well-deserved honor. Unbelievable! She took first place in math, science, and English. But the Helping Hand Award is all mine. She might have cleaned the odd blackboard, but I organized the teacher appreciation luncheon. Food poisoning was a total accident. And finally, to the student deemed most helpful to the staff this year, the Helping Hand Award goes to... Sincerity Travers. <laughs> I've been robbed! Robbed by Sincerity Travers, that old warthog! Now, the words don't mean anything, hon. Sure, unless you win them. I just can't believe... You mean... Forget your troubles, Mimi. It's summer vacation! Whispering Oaks? <laughs> Where else? Dad, you're the best! Mm. Packing is a science. All it takes is a little organization. Can I stay home? I don't want to go on some loser family vacation. Loser vacation? Whispering Oaks is only the most beautiful, the most fun, the most perfect place in the world. I don't know, Marv. I think we're going to need the roof rack. <laughs> Nonsense. I planned it perfectly. Last summer, when we pretended we were pirates diving for sunken treasure? And you threw the car keys into the lake? <laughs> sure do. And the time we buried you in the sand? Mm, yeah, you thought it would work better if you mixed in cement. <laughs> How could I forget? Huh. This is the life, Dad. <sighs> no TV, no phones. And best of all, no sincerity. Marv, you remember my wife, Jubilee, and my daughter, Sincerity? You kept going on about this place, so I figured we should check it out. You told your boss about Whispering Oaks? I never thought he'd find it. Mimi, love your hair. Is that the drip look? <laughs> You'll hate it here. The mosquitoes are like vultures. The water gives you a rash. That's not a rash. That's a zit. <laughs> you come here every summer? For the past ten years. <laughs> you poor dear. Lance really should give Marv a raise. Just tell me they have room service. No, but a funeral service could be arranged. Uh, come along, Pom Pom. <sighs> There's nothing like roughing it to make you feel alive and... <gasps> oh my god! They call that deluxe? Uh, actually, that's our cabin. The deluxe cabin's over there. <laughs> now that's roughing it. See? Inside, we can forget that the Travers are even here. 
What the? I hear there's a vacancy over at Fluttering Furs. I'm packing. So what if my worst enemy showed up? So your boss is here. We can't let them run us out. Whispering Oaks belongs to us, Mortons. Mimi's right. I'm not going to let those people spoil my holiday. You're right. I'll just ask them to turn it down. Uh, hey, I... Wind is ruining my hair. It's a sailing race. Wind is good. What's the point in winning if you don't look good? I need a wind break. Don't! Cool. I won. I have to admit. The Travers are hard to ignore. Huh? Is that... T-Bone? Hey, neighbors! What's cooking? All right! Real food! Say, Marv, as long as you've got time on your hands, how's about finishing off that annual report for me? <laughs> Gee, Lance, I'd uh, love to, uh, uh, but I didn't bring my laptop. Hey, no worries. You can borrow mine. <laughs> sure, Lance. He can't just walk all over Dad like that. Sure he can. Oh, yeah? Says who? My dad's your dad's boss. Your dad has to do whatever my dad says. She can beat me at everything. She can rule the school. But when she acts like her dad is better than ours, we have to prove she's wrong. We? Mimi's got a plan. lucky today. Don't you, Dad? Yeah, sure, Mimi. Lucky. Hey, neighbor! So, Mimi tells me this is your secret fishing spot. She does? Says you won a trophy last year. Yeah, I won the booby prize for smallest catch. A trophy nonetheless. Bombs away! I don't know, Mimi. This whole thing smells bad. Of course it does. It's a day's worth of bait. We had to hook a big one with this. Whoa! This is a great spot! By the way, Marv, how's the report going? Good work, Mimi. Dad's practically got Mr. Travers begging for mercy. Don't feel bad, Mimi. I'm sure there's something your dad's good at. There's plenty my dad is good at. You mean aside from tying his shoes? Well, he... He's a world-famous mountaineer! Mimi? Well, he is! He could 
hike circles around your dad any day. How about tomorrow? Tomorrow it is. Fine. I'll ask my dad if he brought his hiking boots. The ones he used when he led that expedition through the Amazon last summer. Our dad, a world famous mountaineer? For as long as we've been coming to Whispering Oaks, Dad's always taken us on nature hikes. Mom's always taken us on nature hikes. Dad couldn't find his way around the woods if there were street signs. Oh, ye of little faith, Bradley. Dad knows what he's doing. Are you sure you've got everything? Mm, calculator, uh, quarterly cost reports, uh, yeah, everything. How about a compass and trail mix? Don't worry, Mom. Dad and I will survive on our wits and instincts. Last one back's a dirty, rotten skunk. See you at the finish line. Come on, Dad, let's go. We could save time by calling search and rescue now. To the finish line we go. Or mosquito bog. Wild mist. Oh, this will keep him off you. But that's oh, poison ivy. Oh. Uh, Dad, isn't North that way? No, that is south. Then how come the moss is growing on this side of the tree? <laughs> Don't they teach you kids anything? Moss always grows on the south side of the tree. But now hurry up. I have to get back and finish that report. <sighs> you see, Mimi? I, uh, I know exactly where we are. <laughs> Just around these rocks is, uh... More trees. We're lost! We, we are not lost. We're temporarily disoriented. I'm cold and I'm hungry! Sincerity's probably sitting in her hot tub right now laughing at us! Don't worry, sweetheart. Your old dad's got everything under control. Look! A beehive. A, a, a little wild honey's just what we need to perk us up. But, Dad, that's a... Wasp's nest! Run! <laughs> oh. oh, close one. Did you hear something? It's a bear! Quick, hunt this tree! <laughs> Is it a brown bear or a black bear? Why? Because black bears climb trees! It's okay, honey. Daddy's here. Oh. Nice pair. <laughs> really, how'd you going there, huh, Marv? <laughs> This line's just over there. We've been back for two hours. Oh, and Marv, I have that report on my doorstep by morning. We were getting worried. Are you okay? No, I'm not okay. Oh, Bradley, Jason's right. This is a loser vacation. And Dad's the biggest loser of all. Bradley, you awake? No. Mimi's got another plan. We're gonna turn Dad into a hero. Sounds a lot like your last plan. Only this one's gonna work. Hey, Sincerity! You wanna go sailing? 
and wreck my hair again? I don't think so. But they're handing out the most beautiful sailor award today. Why didn't you say so? Hey, if they're handing out the most beautiful sailor award, how come there aren't any other sailboats out today? Why bother? When you're so obviously the winner. <sighs> True. Bradley, I'm busy. But I saw it, Dad. Honest. A real live lake monster. Where? You must have missed it. But isn't that Mimi and Sincerity in that sailboat? No problem, JT. I'm working on the Help annual me. report as we Help speak. Me. Help me! Sorry, JT. What did you say? I can't hear you over the screaming. Help! Help! This can't be happening! I'm Sincerity Travers! What about my most beautiful sailor award? Sincerity, calm down! My dad will save us. <laughs> Your dad? Oh, yeah, like, that's gonna happen. Uh-oh! Uh Dad, I think they're really in trouble. Dad? Kids, I've got you. Mimi, you're okay. Whoa! Are you all right? Say there, Marv's wife. What do you mean by taking my boat without asking? to realize our children could have been hurt? Are you going to let her talk to me like that? She's just telling the truth. See? They're all ill-mannered cretins. Fire him. Sorry, Marv, uh, but she has a point. Well, fire me if you must, but I'm the only one who knows the secret password to the annual report. Mm -hmm. He has a point too, Dumpling. And while we're at it, Lance, I've been meaning to ask for a raise. So there, sincerity. <laughs> sincerity? How'd you like to have dinner with my family tonight? Anyone for another tofu dog? No, thank you, Mrs. Morton. Does she always make you eat compost? Lobster tails, anyone? Uh, lobster tails? Oh, well, it's been real. Maybe too real. Uh, see ya! Jason? They're offering lobster tails next door. Hmm. Nah. Why go for a lobster tail when I can have a whole tofu dog right here? Hmm. Hmm.